morning everyone. It's uh, it's about 6.15 in the morning and I thought I'd uh, come out for my uh, daily walk that I'm allowed to do. So I come out very early in the morning today to uh, just see what I can see today. I'm going back to the, uh, the little owl tree. Thought I'd have a look early in the morning and uh, see what else is around. God, I'm out of breath already. You can see the sun coming up behind me there. It's beautiful sunrise just coming up, so it's quite cloudy, but it's going to be a nice day out here. We're on for some warmer weather soon, so that'll lift our spirits. So, um, so yeah, it's a bit another recce, really. I haven't brought the camera with me again. Just thought I'd come out for my walk while no one's around and see what I can see. So, I'm going to continue to walk across this field. Hopefully, we might see some uh, some hares, maybe. Uh, not seeing it yet. Quite a few crows around at the moment, but uh, I've actually seen someone running over there in the distance. So uh, there are a few people around. But uh, anyway, I hope you're all well, and uh, I'll bring you back in a minute when I get further across this field. I was, uh, was thinking of bringing the camera today, but um, it's quite a big, quite a big bit of kit to carry over here for for no reason. So I think the best thing to do is have a have a quick look around at this time of day. Oh, there's some hares. There's three hares. Wow. Ah, great. Oh, that's amazing. Three hares together. Now I wish I'd brought my camera. That's fantastic. I don't think you can see them, they're just, just running down this bit here. Uh, never mind, I, mean, I would never have uh, never managed to photograph them, they would just run off as soon as they saw me. But uh, oh, that's really good to know, there's hares in this field. They're going running right over there now. Oh, okay. oh there's a fourth one as well. Ah, oh, fantastic. So, excellent. So that could be another project, actually. Um, I have to think it through a bit, how I would... Uh, I'd capture those on camera. Probably what I'd end up doing is, you can see behind me there's this hedge, hedge line there, there's a brook that runs down there which you saw in my last video. Um, so I'll probably come in when it's dark I think and just sit down there with the uh, the camera on a tripod and uh, under, perhaps under a throw of a hide and uh, see what turns up. Um, look at that sunset behind me, sunrise sorry. That's beautiful colours in the sky so Anyway, well that's a good sign. Three hairs, probably four hairs, there's one joined and one over there, so yeah, it's looking promising. So I've walked across the uh, across the field now. Um, and uh, so the hairs were just in this area here as we walked across the field. So what I'm thinking is maybe early tomorrow when it's still dark, I could come over here I can set up down underneath this uh, this tree here. Um, let's say under a under a throw over hide, um, and just sit and wait and see if we get a get a hair in front of the camera. It would be lovely if we do. I've never photographed hair here before. In fact, hairs we don't actually get a lot of hairs around here. I don't I don't see many. Um, certainly on the private land that I spend a lot of my time on. Um, yeah, hardly see a hair at all. So it's a Really lovely to see you know three or four of them here this morning. So I'm gonna remember that for tomorrow, weather permitting, I may be back. So fingers crossed we might get something in the next few days. Yeah, there's uh yeah there's five at least. I can count five hairs over here at the moment, so I'm just trying to keep low and uh, see if I can get, yeah, get in closer to them. Obviously, I won't be able to get any images with this uh, small camera and lens. I'm only carrying the M50 with me today because I carry. The, I did the vlogging the other day on the 1DX Mark II, and it was a, a bit heavy to carry actually. So uh, on the M50 today, so there's no chance of getting an image. But oh, that's amazing. Oh, I'm so pleased because I was beginning to wonder whether we'd, we'd get any photos over the next few weeks. Um, I'm not one for 
doing quick snaps. I like to set projects up and uh, sort of have an image in mind and then try and capture that image. So, yeah, they seem quite tolerant of me, actually. I'm about, I don't know, 100 metres or so from them. So, yeah, they haven't quite seen me yet. There's a thing is, on this field, there's a lot of, uh, lot of stubble. So I'll show you that in a minute. So I'm going to try and get a bit closer, a bit closer now. Still over there. Quite a way away now though. I'll show you the field, this is the field. So they're over in the distance just around here, so yeah, you won't be able to see them on camera. I'm by the uh, by the little owl tree, so I'm gonna um gonna give these hairs a rest now, I'm gonna leave them alone. And I'm gonna just quickly sneak up here and see if I can see the little owl in the tree. So hairs chuffed to bits to see those tonight and um, this morning sorry and uh, definitely a project for uh, tomorrow no no little out there this morning um, I'll give it some time sometimes there's a uh, there's loads of skylark oh there's another hair wow <laughs> just another one they're everywhere at the moment they seem to be hiding down in this uh this stubble. God, I've only got my camera. Isn't that typical, isn't it? I, say, I, th I thought I'd even set it up this morning. I thought, oh, I'll bring my camera and then. And I didn't bother. I thought I'd come and have a recce first. Don't know if you can hear it on camera. Skylark calling away. Always amazed how, uh, how far their song projects for such a little bird because you can't, you can't visibly see it. But uh, I don't know if you can hear it on camera, but. Uh, Seems to be an awful lot of those around here, so it'd be nice to get a photo of those. As I said in my last video, I never managed to photograph it once, and that was on the Isle of Mull, and it didn't turn out as as I wanted it to. So, um, yeah, it's an amazing song there. Well, that's it. Uh, a really uh, short video today, um, but fantastic to see um, hares this morning. I wasn't expecting that, so yeah, chuffed to bits about that, and definitely a project for for tomorrow morning. Um, as I say, I'm going to come over when it's dark, I think, get my video set up so not to disturb anything, and then uh, sit and wait by that tree that I pointed out, probably under a throw over hide, or I might put a, a ghillie suit on, I'm not sure yet. I'll think about it during the day. But um, yeah, what I will do is I'll, I'll dig through my archives of images and see if I can find a couple of hair photos that I've taken in the past. As I said, I've not taken many, so yeah, I'm very excited about trying to capture these ones on, uh, on, on film. So until tomorrow, uh, enjoy your day, stay safe, and uh, see you on the next one. Bye for now.